Chris Harrison is apologizing for, quote, wrongly speaking in a manner that perpetrates racism, while discussing allegations against Bachelor contestant Rachel Kirkenell. This is your Bachelor Brief. The Georgia native, who was a frontrunner for Matt James's final rose, has been subject of growing claims of past racist behavior since the season began last month. One TikTok user alleged that Rachel had picked on her in high school for, quote, liking black guys, while others claimed that she liked offensive social media photos, including one with a Confederate flag. Last week, photos that appeared to show Rachel at an antebellum plantation-themed fraternity party in 2018 surfaced online. Rachel has not verified the authenticity of the photos and has yet to publicly speak out on any of the allegations. Access Hollywood has reached out for comment. During an interview with extra correspondent and former bachelorette, Rachel Lindsay, Chris defended the fact that the contestant had continued to remain silent, saying, quote, the woke police is out there, and this poor girl, Rachel, who has just been thrown to the lions, I don't know how you are equipped when you've never done this before to be woke enough, to be eloquent enough, to be ready to handle this. And my guess is this woman needs a little time. Chris also shared his thoughts on the alleged photos of Rachel at the Old South party, saying, it's not a good look in 2018, or is it not a good look in 2021? Because there's a big difference. Rachel pushed back saying, quote, it's not a good look ever because they're celebrating the Old South. If I went to that party, what would I represent at the party? Chris responded, quote, I don't disagree with you. You're 100% right in 2021, but that was not the case in 2018. Again, I'm not defending Rachel. I just know that I don't know 50 million people did that in 2018. That was a type of party that a lot of people went to. Chris's interview sparked major backlash and now The Bachelor host has taken to Instagram to apologize. He wrote, quote, to my Bachelor Nation family, I will always own a mistake when I make one. So I'm here to extend a sincere apology. I have this incredible platform to speak about love and yesterday, I took a stance on topics about which I should have been better informed. While I do not speak for Rachel Kirkenell, my intentions were simply to ask for grace in offering her an opportunity to speak on her own behalf. What I now realize I have done is cause harm by wrongly speaking in a manner that perpetrates racism, and for that, I am deeply sorry. I also apologize to my friend Rachel Lindsay for not listening to her better on a topic she has firsthand understanding of, and humbly thank the members of Bachelor Nation who have reached out to hold me accountable. I promise to do better.